Steph, Lauren and I have been collaborating for a few years now on lots of different projects. We teach and we have a publication together and I think ACCA kind of got wind of what we were doing in that publication space which was exciting and um, got us in for an interview for the commission and they told us a bit about the space and essentially the space is a, a reading room and a library and a place for people to sit within the um, Australian Centre for Contemporary Arts new exhibition called Who's Afraid of Public Space. The reading room we were really interested in um, allowing for quite an agile, movable kind of room with interactive elements so the carpet in particular became a real anchor to kind of allow the colour to kind of represent you know different ways that you could kind of occupy and use the space. I basically just sent an email to um, GH Commercial uh, explaining the project and what our ambitions were. And we had a really exciting meeting where, you know, they told me about the Rowan exhibition and just, you know, showed me the possibilities and essentially explained to me that you can print anything you want on this carpet, which I had no idea that you could do that. And then from there, basically the process kind of just snowballed and was really exciting. We sent through a concept and GH Commercial then tweaked it to suit the printing machine and their, you know, the scale, I guess. Like we, you know, often we work at the scale of paper, not the scale of a giant carpet. And kind of a little bit of shock maybe as well at, at <laughs> yeah. the kind of scale and, you know, there's as designers obviously we work interacting I guess like artworks in a different way and then being able to sort of understand the presence at a one-to-one -one scale was yeah it was overwhelming and amazing. <laughs> kind of using the technology and able to, to really kind of like amplify the design and what our ambition was initially as well through the kind of technology that was available. We had kind of designed this thing that was far more complex than what we had initially anticipated, but still didn't really believe it could be true. <laughs> and kind of like handed it over to Godfrey Hearst, I guess, and their team took it on and as we said, you know, rescaled it. And then it came back almost, you know, pretty much perfect on the first go. Incredibly confident that whatever we kind of threw at them, they would be able to make it work, which is a really comforting feeling to have as a designer. Well, first impression was, wow, it looks like our computer screen's been blown up into real life. <laughs> and yeah, that it just looks even better than we could have imagined. I think the carpet definitely tells people how to use the room. I think the carpet as a visual guide is definitely doing what we wanted it to do. It's definitely reached its like optimal comfort and warmth like you know just the like the soft furnishings the chairs are just super comfortable the carpet's really soft and yeah so I think that was a real kind of win for us.